Hi, welcome to my another video today, I will help you choose the 5 best A1 printer plotters on the market. I have made it based on my personal researches, and I am trying to list those based on price quality and more. We have included links in the description, so make sure you check those out to see which one is in your budget range. Starting number 1, HP DesignJet T210, want a device that offers high-quality prints at a reasonable price? Then DesignJet T210 would be an ideal option. With 2400x1200 DPI resolutions, the plotter delivers fine details and graphics. It includes four color cartridges that give you vivid printouts on A1 paper. Speaking of the cartridge, the unit has black in 38 milliliters while cyan, magenta, and yellow are in 29 milliliters. It's pretty enough to last around 150 to 190 large format pages. The speed is ideal for a smaller batch. It takes around 45 seconds to have your paper printed. If you're just printing a basic diagram, it would take way lesser time. Setup is pretty straightforward. You can connect the unit to your computer or any device in just 12 minutes. However, assembling the printer can be slightly tricky especially aligning the head and loading the paper parts. In that case, check the setup video or ask someone apt for help. The only major problem with the printer is that it's friendly with plain roll papers. You may not like to use it for special A1 sheet or one thicker than 220 GSM. For that purpose, you can check this Canon model. Also, there's no way to place standard-sized papers other than using its single feeder. If you have a lot of them to print, then we would suggest spending some more bucks and getting a different package. At number 2, Canon Image Prograph TA20, this is a very well-behaved model by Canon. It's designed with an air feeding system that uses a suction fan to prevent the paper from bending or twisting. As a result, it keeps the paper flat and you get a consistent result. TA20 is compatible with both plain and special A1 papers. You can even use sheets as thick as 450 GSM to print out your plots. Setting up the plotter is a 20-minute task. There's a guide included that will walk you through the process easily. Not just that, the unit would be easy to assemble as well as use. When it comes to speed, it outshines the previous HP model. You can get an A1 printed in just 32-ish seconds. This would be a great pick if you have a moderate to a big batch of papers to deal with. You may not like the unit for occasional use as the print head clogs easily. In that case, use any of the three cleaning modes from the plotter's settings depending on the issue. Although the advanced modes have higher chances to solve the issues, they waste more ink than the standard cleaning mode. So, we would suggest you use them wisely. The unit comes with 2400x1200 DPI resolutions that offer crisp images on A1 papers. There are five color cartridges that make the colors mix so perfectly that you get vivid printouts. Since each ink comes in 55 milliliters, the starter tanks can easily produce around 277 A1-slash-D pages. At number 3, HP DesignJet T630, this plotter is mainly a quicker version of the model T210. It prints A1 paper in around 30 seconds which means, you can get two pages printed in a minute. So, T630 would be a suitable printer for a big stack of papers. You can use it for technical line drawings, maps, or posters. Printing at 2400x1200 dpi, the images promise to look sharp, while the small texts on A1 paper would be easy to read. It incorporates four color tanks where three of them come in 29 milliliters and the black in 38 milliliters, thanks to the mix of those colors, you get beautiful prints out of the unit. It includes almost everything to offer you convenience. You get a stand to place the unit, a bin to catch the paper, and an auto feeder to let you use standard sized sheets for multiple printing. As for the roller, it easily accommodates 150 feet long large format papers. Assembling the unit is super easy. It's just the setup that can be time consuming. If the guide and relevant videos don't help much, then we suggest you contact a support specialist. At number 4, Epson Sure Color T5170, T5170 assures colorful prints with its four color ink system. 
you get around 50 milliliters tank of each color that works to yield around 252 A1 pages smoothly. Each printout looks clear and premium with resolutions at 2400 x 1200 dpi. You would find it super easy to connect to your computer or mobile. The whole setup and assembly process would take 10 and 10 equals 20 minutes. A big plus is that the plotter responds to your command pretty quickly regardless of the big distance. Speaking of speed, it does print fast to keep up with your workflow. In just 31 seconds, the printer would provide you with the image on an A1 paper. This unit handles all sorts of media files including roll paper up to 36 inch in width, canvas paper, as well as thicker cardstock. It has a single feed roller for large formats and an auto feeder for sheets of up to 11 times 17 inches. A small drawback is that it works great with proprietary papers. Yes, the plotter will accept different branded papers, but you may have to cut and customize the sheet to make it compatible. So, if you don't want that hassle, it would be better to use the proprietary ones. One good thing is that you will get a paper catcher and a stand along with the printer. And the whole package wouldn't cost a fortune. At number 5, Canon Image Prograph IPF770, best A1 printer for architects, want some flawless line drawings and aerial photos on large format papers? Then take a look at IPF770. It prints with resolutions as high as 2400 x 1200 dpi to give you well-detailed drawings. The big plus is that it comes with 5-color cartridge system where each contains 130 milliliters ink. That's a lot to last more or less 660 pages. Plus, you would even find it ideal for black and white prints as one of the tanks holds pigment matte black. So, if you're looking for architectural designs and plans, this would be suitable for you. IPF 770's roller has enough space to hold a 500 feet long roll of bond paper. So, you can easily send the batches of prints to the unit. Note that, the printer doesn't have an auto feeder, but there's a slot for a single sheet. It's a very quick plotter to have for a huge stack of papers. The unit takes around 25 seconds to print a large format sheet. And for basic mono printing, it acts a lot faster. Setting it up is super simple so is using it. Because it works through cable connection only, the process gets easier. This limitation can be a slight downside as well. If you want to use the plotter remotely, then you have to buy a wireless network adapter. There will be a media and a stand included with the unit. So, you will get a complete package to make the most of. So if you want to buy these products check link in the description box.